Back to my channel, my name is Evelyn. For those of you guys who don't know me, and I am back with another video. So for today, um, we're doing a quarantine, a day in my life during quarantine, online school edition. You know, whatever. I think that's what we're doing today specifically. It is Thursday. It is the 30th, April 30th, and I happen to have school today, so I'm just waiting for the time. I start school at 9.30, school at 9.30, and it ends at 11.30, but I don't really need to attend my 11 to 11.30 class, so I don't go, because it's optional. But yeah, so right now I'm just kind of waiting for the time to happen. I already ate breakfast, actually, and I brushed my teeth and I washed my face, and then Right now, I'm just kind of waiting for the time to head back. Maybe Masculine. Uh, we're talking about a noun in French. There's always going to be gender. Remember that. Come on, we don't flight. Okay, guys. So, I just finished class, and I switched back computers. I have my little mini laptop with my sister. I literally just finished, like, two seconds ago, and we traded back computers. But right now, I'm basically doing nothing. I'm going to take a small break. Take a mini break, or I, honestly, I think I'm going to start my math homework because I have a math test tomorrow, and I'm a bit behind on my math stuff. So I'm just going to take, yeah, I'm just going to take notes on literally everything and then do practice problems at the end of that. I think that's my plan. So hopefully, I can do it. But yeah, just kind of vibing today, looking for places to spay Buttercup. Um, if you don't know Buttercup, she's in there. She is my... She is my Holland Lot, for those of you guys who don't know who she is. I'm just finding out places to, like, spay her. Because she is not spayed, and she's a year old now, and I have not spayed her for several reasons. But I do want to spay her because I do want a second bunny eventually. I would prefer to have a lion head, but, you know, whichever bunny wins my heart. Um... I think I'm going to adopt my next bunny. I don't know if I'm going to buy my next bunny. But I think I'm definitely... Hmm, maybe I'm going to adopt. I'm not too sure about it because I don't have a lot of bunny rescues like, at all near my house. So, it depends on... Or if I do have bunny rescues, they're like really extremely strict about their rules. And I'm like, I have this custom built house. But sometimes they demand that you need to like free roam your rabbit. And I was like, I can't personally do that. 24 hours a day buttercup loves her home like she's vibing like she's literally happy in there um she has plenty of space if i do say so she takes about a quarter of my room so that's a lot of space like most of my bed that's why i'm spaying her because i am getting another bunny there's no questions asked i think it's a great benefit to have two bunnies rather than one if you want me to see go into detail on rabbit care i totally can i might redo a, the last video that i made a rabbit care and just delete it because i didn't really like that video i feel like it wasn't like i still didn't know enough so i might refilm that and post it or if you want to see a rabbit channel with buttercup featuring buttercup all the time let me know like i think that'd be kind of fun like not gonna lie but also like you know but yeah i think i want to do that for her so yeah i think that's what i'm gonna keep doing researching places to take her and spay her and Maybe catching up on some math work. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. We're going to clean up her cage today because it also happens to be cleaning up her cage. So yeah, let's get started. I know this world can be so cruel. We have our hands tied. Okay guys, so quick update. Um, I'm still cleaning the Buttercup's cage. It's low-key almost done. I just have to sweep my room and her cage, just like some parts I couldn't really scrub off there so I couldn't get them all out. But just a fair warning, the wood looks really gross, but like it's because it's wet, it's not because it's dirty or it's pissed or something. I promise. Um, but look, so I pretty much finished cleaning out her house. Trust me, she has a lot of space. So, yeah, um, that's basically what I've been doing. I'm about to broom my whole room right now because when you have a rabbit and you clean your cage, you know, you get literally hay everywhere. So, yes, I have my own mini broom and a big broom in my room. My mom does not approve of me using her broom. Well, hold up. Let me, like, unplug this because she really wants to be chewing out of it today. Anyway, we have to get charger protectors for that. 
anyway, as I was saying, I yes, I have my own broom in my room because a rabbit. You know, my mom doesn't approve of me using just a normal broom around the whole house. I don't know why. She, it just grosses her out, which honestly, understandable because it's bunny poop sometimes. She does have a few potty mistakes here and there, so makes sense. So yeah, I'm just going to broom my room really quick and then probably going to organize my bunny supplies and wash her bowls. Because my room be looking a little rough today, so I'm going to put her back in her cage for now. I'm going to take her out to free room a little bit later once I'm all done. So yeah, let's keep doing that. I never know how to do a transition for anything, so peace out. Okay guys, so as you guys saw, I literally just had dinner and stuff like that, so right now I'm just gonna start doing my math, aka my geometry homework right now, because why not? I'm low-key kind of like, dead right now for no reason. I ate too much, let's just put it there. I have no idea how my sister ate three sopes, I ate two. I have no idea how she fit them in her small little stomach and her small little self, but I literally could not eat, like I'm stuffed. So, I gave myself, again, another 10 minute break, so, um, yeah, so usually after dinner I would either find something else to do or, I, like today, I would work on more homework and stuff like that. Also, just a little, today is, uh, just a little thing that I want to say, today's April 30th and it's El Dia del Niño, aka, let me translate that for you guys, the Day of the Children or the Day of the Child. Um, this is like... In Mexico, it is very much celebrated. A child is celebrated, and they do like these f activities for the kids. And that happens to be today, which is kind of sad because my sister doesn't get to do it this year. Um, but yeah, so my mom actually bought ice cream and stuff to make a sundae so she can like still celebrate a little bit. Usually, she makes us our favorite food and like stuff like that. Today, she made sopas, which is one of my little sister's favorite food. Like she loved them so much, so that's why she made that today. And I low key love them too. Like they're so good. But yeah, that's what she made today, and that's why we were eating that. It's also, you know, the child's day or whatever, which is really fun, and I'm really looking forward to the ice cream in my mom box. It looks so good. So I'm going to try to finish my homework before my mom comes home. That way I can eat ice cream with them and not be left out. So yeah, let's get started with that, because I really, really do need to finish this. <laughs> okay, peace out. Okay, guys, I know the lighting in here is extremely bad, but literally my mom seems to be following me wherever she goes, and I cannot make this transition. Well, she's coming again. Lord. <laughs> I'm trying so hard. Anyway, guys, that's all I was saying and tell you guys about my plants. I said enough ranting about the plants. I basically finished my geometry homework, and I am basically all done with that. And I am finally, finally all cut up. I just need to catch up to chemistry tomorrow. And I am A-OK. -okay, finally. Like, I'm not even going to lie. I've been waiting for this day for so long. So I've been procrastinating so long. Because I'm just a big procrastinator. Anyway, like I was telling you guys earlier. It's actually Children's Day. And my mom really likes to do something for us. So let me show you how the kitchen is going. It's not like a, like an outstanding thing. But let me show you guys. Since they want to be talking everywhere. Do you wanna, so, this is how our kitchen be looking like with the balloons on every single I chair. Yeah, she's just decorating the chairs. It says Felicia del Niño. We have our hands tied, they treat us like we're fools. Mm, yeah. We underestimated, embarks in all judgmental labels, spread Hey guys, so it's literally 12 right now. I just finished doing all the ant stuff. It's like 11.55 right now. And I just finished like taping off all the areas because we have ants and I'm finally done, which is nice. And I'm finally just getting ready for bed right now. But yeah, I'm just going to get ready for bed and just hit the hay, just go to sleep because I'm really tired. But yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to go follow me on Eve underscore 1436 and follow my rabbit on Instagram at buttercup underscore the Holland Lop. Make sure to follow me on TikTok as well in case if you're interested. It is actually on 
Evelyn Mora, the O in Mora, is a zero, and that's all my social media for now, but let me know if you guys want to see more of that. If you guys want to see any content that you guys like, or any good questions you guys have for me, leave them down in the comments below. I will gladly answer them. But yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.